so we are having build uh, battery right so battery voltage is 380 volt and then here we are having capacity is 48 h so initial state of charge will be 50 percent okay and it directly is connected to the uh, here the bldc motor drive with the local load okay so this is known as the local load of electrical vehicle so it will be made at around 1000 watts and here the bldc motor drive right so it will be acting as electric vehicle so this electric vehicle uh, it can sub, uh, it can draw maximum power of uh, uh, 1000 to 1500 watts okay so here we need to control the speed of the uh, this electric motor okay so for that here you are measuring the speed of the machine and when we compare with the reference speed okay so here we are increasing the uh, reference speed from 0 to 2000 and then it when we maintain um, 2000 after that it, it again changed to 2000 to 0 so here you can see the timing right from 0 to 1.5 the speed will be increased from 0 to 2000 from 1.5 to 3.5 the speed maintained at 2000 from 3.5 to 5 right speed will be changed from 2000 to 0 okay so the error speed will be processed by api controller so it will be generated the so it's going to be generated the duty cycle it's going to be processed so it will be generated okay so it will be generated the controlling pulse so another one thing we need to do in the build this motor we need to send the hall sensor uh, output right so the hall sensor going to be converted into back game of by using this logic after back game of so we need to generate the gating drive pulse okay so back game of going to be converted into gating drive pulse and then that uh, drive pulse going to be combined with the controlling pulse and then uh, it going to be given this old sourcing motor so we can uh, buy we can control the speed of the build dc motor okay and also here we have solar panel so solar panel connected to the, the common point battery okay and also here we have charger controller so charger controller here we are measuring the soc of the battery and the battery voltage okay so the soc of the battery will be compared with the 100 percentage if the soc of the battery less than 100 percentage and SOS that mean battery voltage is less than 442 volt right so we need to use solar going to charge the battery okay so as well as supply the power to the electric vehicle if suppose uh, SOC of the battery is equal to 100 percentage and then battery voltage more than 442 right? 4, uh, 442 right so then we need to disconnect the solar panel for from charging from the battery okay and for that we have the setup right uh, here i'm going to simulate the model here you can see the measurement of pv so pv voltage current and power so here you can measure the uh, battery voltage battery current battery power and here you can measure the that mean input for that uh, electric vehicle okay input current input power and then here you can measure the stator current and the emf of the plane emf of that uh, bldc motor and here you can see that speed of the machine and the torque of the machine okay so here i am going to simulate this model and then here we have that the change in the radiation condition right so we are changing the radiation for every one seconds and then uh, and uh, the irradiation will be changed from 1800 500 300 100 right for every one seconds So here I'm going to simulate this model. So you can see that uh, power PV power and the battery charging detail, charging discharging detail. Okay, when PV power goes low, right, then we are getting the and then here you can see that so battery. Mm -hmm. yeah. Here you can see that
so pv powers around 2000 right so it can supply the power to the electric vehicle as well as it can be charged the battery so here you can see that based upon this torque it's also associated with the battery right? so SOS is keep on increasing because there is excess power in our available the pv so that can be used for charge the battery as well as supply the power to the electric vehicle okay so here you can see that when power is decreasing right so when power is decreasing the load power is increasing right then battery comes to ideal condition now battery in ideal condition so battery neither a discharge nor a charging right so uh, during this condition uh, solar power directly supply the electric vehicle so battery not goes to charging mode now you can see that so pv power comes to zero so sir, pv power comes to around uh, uh, 1500 so now the battery comes for discharging now battery is supplying power to the electric vehicle now okay so because uh, there is power available in the pv so initially up to uh, two seconds right uh, they are going to charge the battery as well as uh, supply the power to the electric vehicle after two seconds right pv power comes to less than uh, around 1500 so that is not enough for drive the electric vehicle so during that time battery will be supply the power to the electric vehicle uh, once the pv power goes to fully uh, that means around zero condition right so battery fully taking the uh, control of uh, electric vehicle that means so battery going to be supply the power to the electric vehicle okay always So this is working of this model and also you can see that so this is the variation of auto speed it will be increased from 0 to 2000 rpm and then is maintained 2000 rpm and then again is changed from 2000 to 0 rpm okay so this is the working of this model so now you can see that after two second battery charging mode after two second battery discharging mode because there is no power in the pv so both condition right so electric vehicle uh, continues uh, getting power from the battery as well as solar okay so if there is no power in the solar the battery try to supply the power to the electric vehicle and also if these two conditions meet out right it automatically disconnect from this solar will be disconnect from the system and battery alone going to supply the power to the electric vehicle okay thank you So for the time I'm going to make here 100 percentage. And then I'm going to simulate the model. Now you can see the battery SOC, right? Battery SOC is 100 as well as the battery gold is more than 442, right? So then the PV is disconnected from the system, so that's why PV power goes to zero. So the battery is fully responsible for supplying power to the electric vehicle, okay? So there is no power from the PV, and then only battery will be used for supplying power to the electric vehicle, okay? So this is the working of this model, okay? So that means uh, when SOC is near to uh, that means uh, equal to 100 and then the battery voltage is more than 442 volt, right? Then we need to stop the uh, charging from the PV. So so it automatically solar PV is disconnected from the system because of this condition. Okay. So this is uh, during that the SOC is 100 percentage. Okay. So to uh, show the results. For both condition right so just first you go to make uh, 50 percentage here and then you can run the model and then take the result and then you can make here you can 100 percentage and then simulate the model and take the results okay thank you